Welcome back to Snow Runner, guys and girls. Now, as you can see, we are back with three very strange mods, which you should check out on Snow Runner. Now, as you can see, we have got the taxi, the construction worker, and the shrimp. Yeah, it's going to be interesting. We're going to start, though, with this. It's a little rickshaw. Now, my hopes for this are low, to put it at best. They are very low. I know they're quite-ish stable, very underpowered, but we'll see what we can do with it. So let's see, we've got rickshaw version one, two, and three. Of course, we're going to go with the high-powered rickshaw. Uh, let's go with a highway box suspension. Oh, it's already on raised. Oh, that's concerning. It can go up to a 24-inch tyre. That's not alarming. Let's uh, give it its best shot at some chunky little mud tyres. Uh, winch. Let's do unpowered because I know it's going to roll. It's got a snorkel. That's useful so that you can drown before your car. That's, you know, as you do. So we've got a little thing. We can have some carpets. A rain cover. Okay. Rear visor. Oh, so you can see out the back. That's actually quite dope. Uh, repair items. Yeah, why not? Yeah, let's have that as well. There's a side door. Okay. Got to keep that bottle in there. Spare wheel. Okay. And front visor. Okay. So you can just stick everything on there if you want to. Uh, let's do visuals rear bumper. So we've got that. And um, I can't even see what it's changed. Oh, there's a little ladder. Oh, and you can sit the. You can just stick everything on here. Okay, let's do the roof lights. It, it's got the coolest little bar. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, let's have the little wheels now. What have we got? We've got engineer unit. We've got military. Visit Sri Lanka. And another visit Sri Lanka. Ah, uh, oh, I don't know what I want to do. Uh, yeah, let's go blue for the visit Sri Lanka. I don't know. I've never been, but if you've been to Sri Lanka in the comments, let me know. I'm curious what it's like. So we have got a hundred liter fuel tank and. Not much else. So, let's see. Oh, my God. It can't get any grip with these tyres. Oh, no. I'm so sorry, little one. Right, but we're off. And the interior, I must say, is modelled very nicely. But, uh, well, ow. Ooh! Okay, I've already damaged it quite badly. Okay. Okay. So let's have a little look. I'm not going to go for the deep thing because I'm not an idiot. But look at it. It's actually doing it. Go, little buggy man. Uh-oh. You know, how is it this thing is based on a word? Uh-oh. I, I thought I was in trouble then. Go around the big tree. There we go. Yeah, look at it go. Oh! I wasn't worried. I wasn't worried. Oh my. Oh my. You know, since this is the highway box, it's even more concerning because, you know, this is supposed to be the fast one. Oh shit. Ah! Nailed it! So let's have a little looky Lou. Now. Can it go through a puddle? There's a lot of mud. The guy's getting some very wet toes. But it's actually slowly doing it. It's not a completely useless pile of garbage. I, I spoke too soon. Shit. Well, shit. 
Yeah, we're fucked with that. Uh, on to the... Skid steer. So, this thing is supposed to be a little... Oh my god, oh my god, look at the little thing it's doing, a jiggle. Like, header, 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 header. It, it's just carving its way through the top. But whilst it's doing that, this thing has no steering. It, it basically just rotates on itself. So, if I do that... As you can see, it rotates fully on it. So look how cool that is! So let's see what... Oh my god, the arm. The arm is already annoying me. So engine, we've got stock or OP. Let's go for OP. Uh, let's go for high range. Suspension, there is none. Winch, let's do console friendly. Line, rear bumper. Okay, we can add heft. Uh, let's add a little bit of chunk. Front bumper, we can have a basic bucket, forks, or a gra- Oh, that's so cool! And wheels, you can't change. Uh, I'm gonna keep it yellow, but bobbleheads. What, uh, I wanna put Mr. Walrus there, because Mr. Walrus is alright. And then let's put a dream catcher there. I don't know why, but that looks terrifying. Oh god, I can't get used to this steering. It's just like, snap, snap. Now, the question is, will I actually be able to grab something? So, I've got to find something I can... ...kind of grab. That's really too big. Let's try and grab a metal roll. So, let's do the grab a bucket controls. Now, luckily, they are a double control. So you can just access it whilst driving. What the hell? The wheel just sunk into the ground. Oh no, oh this is. Right, what? Right, so that does that. Left trigger goes up, down, tilt, and grab. Okay. This can only go well, in my mind. Shit. Right, let's go around the other side. Eh. Oh, this, this is going to be a pain in the up. Stop it. Behave. Oh my god, behave! Turn, you bitch! Ow! Right, I'm just going to try and grab something over there. I'm just going to try and grab something over there. Oh! Well, that ain't working at all, is it? Does this look normal to you? Tell me if this looks normal to you. Okay, for someone who is highly more skilled than me, we'll be able to get this to work. I can't, because I'm a buffoon, but it's cool nonetheless. And now we go on to this. This is the IXRC car. Now, this is made by the insane people over at IX. This is a full little RC car. You might remember the last RC car. The little dumper truck. But this is a hell of a lot faster. So we've got an RC motor, can't change that. RC gearbox, can't change that. RC suspension, can't change that. OP mud tires, can't change that. And winch, can't change that. Fantastic! We can't change jack shit about it. But I want to see... Oh! Th that reverse is a bit of a lunge. So. Oh my god. Okay. Come on. Come on, little man. Come on. Come on, little man. Defeat the twigs. If I get to the river, I will be happy. Oh fuck, it's fast. It's, uh, it's genuinely fast. Like, obviously, it's an IX product. I can't see it. Can you imagine doing hide and seek with these fucking things? It would be 
impossible. But can I just say how cute this looks going down the... Oh! It's just carving its way through the rock. Turn! Turn! For the love of Tom Cruise, turn! I don't even know where I'm attached to. Oh, oh, there I am! Help! Help! There we go. All I can say is, holy shit, this thing did not like it. But now, you're going to see a massive time cut, as I'm going to go and shut this off the mountain. Because I think it's going to be a funny idea. So, I'm going to cut to that now. Yeah! Look at it go! I have no idea what happened there. Also, can I just say, this is the cutest little thing ever. Now, the last one couldn't get over this. If you can get over this, you're already better. You're already better. And you're so adorable. Can I just address how cute this thing is? Look at it! It's so cute! Also, I would like to stress... Uh, it's carrying quite a lot of fuel. So, actually, this is just an idea I've just had. You could buy these for like 150 credits each and plot them around a map you're working and you've instantly got a free fuel station. That is kind of broken. Also, it's going. It's going. It's going. Oh my god, it's going. Ah! We Oh no, it's sunk. Quick! Save it! Save the little man! Oh, I forgot I was in neutral. I thought it was stuck for a second there. But no! The impenetrable little mite lives on! I love him! I love him so much! Even though there is engine damage, which is concerning, and I can't see where the fuck I'm going. Oh my, what happened to you? Oh, you poor thing. Oh, I've killed him. I've killed the little mite. Oh, I feel so bad. Oh, but anyway, that has been your look at the weird, the wonderful, and the adorable in the SnowRunner. Go check out these mods. They're so fun to play around with. I've been your host, Mr. Gage. Check out other videos appearing on screen shortly, and I'll see you in the next video, whatever it may well be. Peace!